Farmer Mac and its board members. July 8, 2020. Overview. The Federal Agricultural Mortgage Corporation, Farmer Mac, is a secondary market for agricultural mortgages. It purchases loans from originating lenders and provides other risk management tools to facilitate the agricultural lending market. It was created by Congress as a privately funded government-sponsored enterprise, GSE, similar to the housing GSEs such as Fannie Mae. Farmer Mac is governed by a 15-member board of directors, five of whom are nominated by the President and confirmed by the Senate. In December 2019, the Senate confirmed a new board member, Lawana Wilcher, who was named chairperson of the board. In January 2020, President Trump nominated Charles Stones for another board position that remains pending. Congressional oversight is provided by the House and Senate Agriculture Committees, which have primary jurisdiction for the Farmer Mac statutes. Farmer Mac Farmer Mac was established in the Agricultural Credit Act of 1987, PL 100 233, Title VII, as a secondary market for agricultural loans. It purchases and pools qualified loans and may sell them to investors as securities or hold them in its own portfolio. It provides risk management tools to originating lenders that let them make more loans to agricultural borrowers and satisfy regulatory requirements. Statutorily, Farmer Mac is part of the Farm Credit System FCS and is codified in the Farm Credit Act of 1971, 12 U.S.C. Section 2279A, CCRS Report 21278 Rupees, Farm Credit System. Financially and corporately, however, Farmer Mac is a separate entity from the FCS. Each has no liability for any of the other's debt. Administratively, Farmer Mac and the FCS have the same federal regulator, the Farm Credit Administration, CCRS in focus IF10767, Farm Credit Administration and its board members. Farmer Mac is an investor-owned corporation, not a member-owned cooperative like the FCS. Two classes of voting stock exist for 1. banks and insurance companies and 2. the FCS. Any investor may own non-voting stock. As an independent entity, Farmer Mac is not supported by congressional appropriations and is not part of the U.S. Department of Agriculture, USDA. Farmer Mac operates in four primary lines of business, farm and ranch, USDA guarantees, rural utilities, and institutional credit. In the farm and ranch business line, most activity is from Farmer Mac promising to buy specific agricultural mortgages under future adverse conditions by selling long-term standby purchase agreements to financial institutions. The purchase agreements guarantee loans against default risk, while the originating lender retains interest rate risk and loan servicing responsibilities. In the guarantee line, Farmer Mac purchases the portion of loans that are guaranteed by USDA, thereby accepting the interest rate risk but carrying no default risk. The rural utilities business line involves mostly loans to rural electric cooperatives. The institutional credit portion supports the general obligations of eligible financial institutions, defined as having borrowers and portfolios that are eligible for other Farmer Mac business. At the end of 2019, Farmer Mac's total business volume, similar to assets, was $21 billion, up 7% over 2018. The largest share of Farmer Mac's business, nearly half, is in institutional credit, followed by farm and ranch, USDA guarantees, and rural utilities. Its core earnings that exclude the effects of valuation fluctuations and infrequent or unusual transactions was $94 million in 2019, up 12% over 2018. Board Members Congress prescribes a 15-member board of directors for Farmer Mac, 12 U.S.C. Section 2279-A2. Five are presidentially appointed and Senate confirmed, five are elected by stockholders to represent banks and insurance companies, and five are elected by other stockholders to represent the FCS. Five presidentially appointed and Senate confirmed. For the five presidentially appointed and Senate confirmed board members, the statute does not specify a term length but says that such board members serve at the pleasure of the president. The president names one of the appointees to be chairperson of the board, 12 U.S.C. Section 2279-A2, a Table 1. Table 1. Presidentially appointed members of the Farmer Mac Board of Directors. 
The presidential appointees are to represent the general public and may not have been officers or directors of financial institutions. Not more than three may be of the same political party, and at least two shall be farmers or ranchers. 12 U.S.C. Section 2279-A2 C.I.I.V. The current slate of presidential appointees includes Lawana Wilcher, confirmed in 2019, whom President Trump designated as chairperson of the board. Lowell Junkins, the former chairman, was named vice chairman and has served since his appointment in 1996. Other presidentially appointed board members include Sarah Fevra, confirmed in 2010, Miles Watts, confirmed in 2010, and Bruce Sherrick, confirmed in 2012. For the statutory requirement that not more than three of the presidential appointees be of the same political party, three are affiliated with the Republican Party Wilcher, Watts, and Sherrick, and two with the Democratic Party Junkins and Fevra. A nominee, Charles Stones, is pending Senate action to replace Sherrick. President Trump nominated Stones in January 2020, PN 1420. Figure 1 is a timeline showing the service of the presidentially appointed board members of Farmer Mac since its inception. 10 elected representing banks and farm, credit system. The other 10 members on the Farmer Mac board that represent commercial banks and the FCS are elected to one-year terms by the shareholders of the respective classes of stock 12 U.S.C. Section 2279-A2, A5. They may serve until their successors take office and may be re-elected. Statute expresses no other qualifications. The Code of Federal Regulations 12 CFR 651 prescribes a Code of Business Conduct and Ethics for Farmer Mac. This code states that the board may recommend to the president that a presidential appointee on the Farmer Mac board be removed if the board determines that the member has violated the code. Figure 1. Presidentially appointed members of the Farmer Mac Board of Directors, 1988-2020. Jim Monk, Specialist in Agricultural Policy.